Welcome to Thoughts Roundup. I want to tell you a story that I've never told you. I know every once in a while I repeat, but not today. It's a little unusual story. My uncle and I, Uncle Oscar, Uncle Oscar was a great preacher and a great pastor. And he was a fun guy also. My mother's name was Dyess, D-Y-E-S-S, -E -S -S, and his name was Dyess, that was mother's brother. All my uncles were, had their unique way and uh, all the dices told stories and uh, we enjoyed being together. I miss them. They're all gone. Uh, I guess I'm almost gone too. So anyway, uh, We were sitting in a restaurant. I could tell you what the restaurant's name is, but I, for some reason, I, I'll hold that. But, uh, no, no, it was Shoney's restaurant. It was, it's all right. So anyway, uh, We was eating. Now, Shoney's used to have a kind of a, a, a clear ceiling, a plastic ceiling or something on part of their, uh, their store, their restaurant. I loved, I loved to eat at Shoney's. I don't, I don't even know where one is now, but I love it. But anyway, my uncle and I were sitting all the way at the back of the restaurant and we could see out across the pasture while I was eating and all of a sudden there was a man drove up with an old rickety trailer and all he had on that trailer was a chainsaw. Well, there was one of those old big Louisiana trees, you know, that had long limbs. Well, trees over there can be 50, 60 or more feet long, and the limbs as big as uh, a lot of trees. <laughs> and he came out there and uh, took that chainsaw out and my uncle said, that's Brother Anthony Mangan's property or either the church's property. I, it's, some of the, it's the church or either Brother Mangan's. And so, okay, I just figured it's one of the brothers from the church probably. And we were sitting there eating and enjoying the visit. And all of a sudden, that place exploded. It exploded, folks. Two limbs came through the ceiling, out, and and there was a limb on the uh, left side of my uncle, and one on my right side. And all the lights went out. In fact, the lights went out of a third of Alexandria. It was all hooked in some way. And my uncle, just as he lifted his fork to put another bite in his mouth, he said, oh, see, that man is going to have a bad day. <laughs> and it took several hours to get the electricity back. I never heard anything more about it. 
but you just don't ever know. As the old man said one time, you don't know what minute's going to be next. Well, boom, debris. But we finished our breakfast before we decided to move along. You know, here's the truth, Doug. We need to be real careful about the way we live, how we treat each other, because we don't know when, boom, And I guess there's another lesson in this. My uncle kind of taught me, don't get too excited about a lot of things that you had nothing to do with and can't help. Just relax and let it pass over. <laughs> yeah. I remember that good food as shown as breakfast, breakfast, God bless you.